I got a vintage machine from the back of my shed here. This is an old crescent snow blower with a five horse to come saw on it. This is one that my uh, father had actually bought new back, uh, I was guessing 80s, 70s. I don't remember when he said he got it from, but you know, it's an old single stage. This uh, pin system here. Pretty basic snowblower, just you know, single stage with a uh, transmission of sorts. Very basic in out, no speeds. It's either moving or it's not. And this is a machine that he had always, uh, you know, stored indoors and taken care of, as you could tell just by looking at it. You know, the paint's in good shape, there's no oil leaking on it. <coughs> We got a basic listless bolts, but when you tilt the chute there, chain drive, hard plastic wheels or rubber or something. No rubber. This one used to have chains on it. I have no idea what happened to the chains. That's the model number there. Sears Roebuck. Number one for sure. That old logo, so this is probably 70s, I guess. I don't remember how to read it. It comes to numbers here. But I just found this kind of funny. This is the, uh, I don't know if he did this or not, but this is the old style uh, shutdown system. We short the spark plug, but it has a boot on it. So you could see it kind of dug into it, to make it work. Underneath it. Basic nothing here. So you know, this thing's always just been mediocre. It's done the job. Oh look at this. <laughs> Push pull on this one, not even a current. So just take enough space in the shed so this is going. I'm gonna just throw it up on eBay or something, just get rid of it. Probably not even gonna try to start it. It's good. I know it didn't have spark about 15 years ago. And I really just have no interest in fixing it. That's it for this machine.